What kinds of humanitarian aid would the U.S. like to see reaching the Palestinians before Israel launches a ground invasion? Let's, can I bifurcate that question? Because I don't, I'm not going to sit here and assume that there's going to be some sort of a ground invasion. And I'm certainly not going to speak to hypothetical timing if there's going to be. Let's just talk about humanitarian assistance writ large. And you heard Kareem, we are getting food, water, medicine in uh, to, to Gaza, not enough. I mean, there's been, I think, what, uh, three convoys, uh, some little less than 60 trucks. That's a good start, but it is just a start. We want to see it keep going. And I think over the coming days, you're going to continue to see convoys of trucks getting in. Uh, but it's also, you know, uh, fuel is also an issue. Uh, we know um, that you need fuel to run the power generators in hospitals. You need fuel to run the pumps and in the desalination uh, facilities so that people can drink fresh uh, healthy water. So fuel is another thing that we're that we're working on. But whether or not there is a ground invasion, do you view humanitarian aid getting there first as important? Whether or not there's a ground invasion, we believe that humanitarian assistance flowing to the people of Gaza is critically important, and it needs to go as soon as possible and as much as possible. And where does the president stand on this? Because if there was some confusion over the weekend about whether or not he had said that yes. He does want Israel to wait until human assistance, humanitarian assistance can get to the Palestinians before any invasion. We have been, we have been crystal clear uh, with our partners in the region, including Israel, that we want to see humanitarian assistance flow. There's been no change to our posture on that at all. But as I said, I think to Steve's question, we're not dictating military terms to the Israeli Defense Forces. They have a right and a responsibility to go after these terrorists, and they certainly are, are gonna do it in a way that they choose to, uh, that they believe is appropriate to the threat. We're definitely gonna support them in terms of providing the capabilities for them to continue to prosecute Hamas terrorists. In fact, security assistance has continued to flow uh, over the course of the weekend, and it will. But we're not dictating terms to them. 